Hi, Jay. First off, I want to apologize. Um, I spoke and behaved badly when I accused you of not knowing that others besides atheists stepped up when Nick Gisborne was banned. You knew better, and I shouldn't have said it. It was a knee-jerk reaction on my point, but I was kind of hostile because of, well, whatever reason, it doesn't matter. It was a wrong thing of me to do. So, again, I apologize. However, I do view what you're doing with the Muslims as an appeasement to them. Hate speech requires no, nego no negotiations. It's simple. If you exhort violence to be, be committed on a person or group of people for various reasons, that's hate speech. To say something is damn silly is not hate speech. What Nick Gisburn did was not hate speech. I don't view what Clem Webb did as hate speech because, well, he's just damn silly and can be quite amusing at times. That's all he is. He's also possibly a coward. I mean, I said, uh, YouTube mail to him, and he still hasn't read it as of the posting of this video. And it was a polite email, too. Um, with Firefly 515? Well, let's put it this way. I did a video in regards to him. I chose to put background music to it. And the background music I put to it was dueling banjos. I think that says it all. Now with the cane, I'm not trying to put you in the middle of it. You're amongst the reasonable atheists. With people like an Angel 13, Draymond Bane, and Major Distraction, Alphabetic Water. And I just figured you have more interaction with the cane than I'm willing to, hence my asking you how many were banned, because I'm certain he would be more willing to talk to you than <coughs> the drunken sot here. I'm certain you saw his video regarding me. I chose not to debate him because... He was so far off. I did make a video, but I decided not to post it in response to his video. Because I feel he behaved very badly. And I would just let his video speak for itself.